Here's a crazy floor brush design. This is from my friend Mark. Remember the guy with the uh, vac in? The only one in the United States that has a vac in installed in his house and I did the install. Well, he loves to find crazy vacuum attachments online and order them and then play with them and get tired of them and give them to me. So, thank you, Mark. This is a Hugo, as in Hugo buy this. Uh, one of those crazy Amazon brands, I guess, that's like a nonsense word. Um, this was still available as of the last time I checked on Amazon. It, uh, it is reputed to fit um, inch and a quarter and 35 millimeter, but I found that it did not fit inch and a quarter directly, and in order to use an inch and a quarter wand, I had to use this little Mila adapter, which then allows it to work. But the deal with this is, it's got a pivoting neck like a regular floor brush. This does a, a little bit of movement. It doesn't have a great range of motion here, but that's not an impediment I've found. But this is a split floor brush. It's got two little independent wings that are spring loaded and can flex back and forth and then return to the middle. And there is a castle cut brush, different cut on the front than the back. So, thoughtful design, and kind of strange to use. Um, I don't know that I'm in love with it, but I don't mind it either. It's kind of cool. So, the idea is that you, you know, you can get up really close to something. Kind of neat. Now let's just see, even though this is a floor brush, everybody uses their floor brush on the rugs from time to time, and let's see if this lets you do that. It actually kind of does. Uh, unlike the Axis or the Wessel, um, what is that, the RD330, the Turn and Clean, you can't really use that on a rug, but this one is letting you do it somewhat. Now I suppose there might be a tiny little center area that's not swept, but because the brushes have vents cut in them at these locations, I don't think that would be a problem at all. There's also another, another slot cut here, so. Kind of neat, kind of different. It does have a rather tall profile. You know, that's a good probably four inches off the ground on account of on account of the swivel mechanisms inside. They had to have room for those, but crazy design. Never saw anything like it. Kind of neat. Hope you enjoyed me sharing that with you. Happy Friday. Happy vacuuming.